Hey, what's up guys? It's been a really long time since I've done a video. Um, I just had a notion to do one now because uh, I'm just now going through some of Anthony's old things. So I just kind of wanted to share some of the stuff that's going through my head right now, you know. Kind of been putting this off for a while, obviously. It's been three and a half years. Um, it's been a rough three and a half years. This is stuff that most people don't know because you look at this channel like it's about comics. And it's all about comics and our comic book dreams and a lot of it is obviously but it's become much bigger than that so Anthony was a very intelligent young man who studied many of things here's some books I've just been pulled just lately this is some of the stuff that he was just recently reading. Economics. Here's some older books when we, uh, well, not the Greco-Roman, but uh, Fanning the Flame and some other old books written by Christian authors uh, in a time when we were questioning our faith in Christianity. Uh, he just would research that stuff. There's a lot of books in here. A lot. I actually went out and I, and I bought a bookshelf. Whoops. It's in my room in there. That's some of his books too. Look at that. Physics for Dummies. Um, so I know this channel is pretty much dead now. But for me it's not. I'm still living it whether or not I'm posting about it. Uh, I just recently turned 30 years old. So I'm an old man now. <laughs> now 30 is the first step to becoming old, I think. Um, I'm going to start making some changes in my life. It's hard to make big changes in your life. You become so accustomed to your day-to-day -day stuff that it's just hard to make a change and stick with it. But I'm going to try. Very hard. And I am going to document it. I'm going to use this channel to do that. I don't know I don't know how it's going to turn out. Obviously, you never do know how things are going to turn out. But it's time. I know that Anthony wouldn't want me to leave the channel stagnant like this. I know that for a fact. And it's time to make a change. I'm probably going to start by showing you guys some of the changes that I have already made. Look at all this lead. I'm sure some of you artists out there are like, oh, I wish I had that. <laughs> and yes, he has some of his blue lead in here. He kind of got a lot of people started on the blue lead you should go watch that video if you haven't seen it and here's some of our original we made these <laughs> business cards obviously these numbers are not right so you can call them if you want but you won't find me on the other end um, we made these for the 2008 San Diego Comic Convention. Actually, I found this too. 
So not only we made those to kind of pass out to uh, comic book publishers. Here's a, here it is. Oh, it's 2007. I knew that. That's what I thought. Well, how the years fly, huh? There's mine, and of course my little pass. And look at I have like my I wore that. I punched a hole in it so I could wear it, and maybe somebody would stop me and ask about it. You know, somebody's probably wondering who those characters are on the front. You might recognize one of them. It's a lot to Rona. There's a lot you guys don't understand about that. I never got a chance to really explain, but I will. Well, I guess you could call this an update. I don't know. I just feel like there's a big part of my life that I'm not pursuing that I should be. I feel it. And it doesn't feel good. It gives me anxiety. But I'm going to start doing that. Thanks for watching. If you're still around, I'll be back.